Put your arms behind your back. You are under arrest. Oh, no. For grand theft person. Oh. And that uh gets you about three to five years for the first offense. Huh? What? That's not fair. Mom, let her go. Let her go. us. We're close. Copy that. Man, I'm sick and tired of these wasted time calls. I cannot wait for some real action. Said I'm stuck here babysitting a rookie. Foster, don't start your limpy stuff with me today. I'm not in the mood. Watch your rookie mouth, okay? You're in whatever mood I tell you you're in. You know, I'm not gonna tolerate much more of your bossing me around. You know, you're not up for a promotion to be captain or lieutenant or something. <laughs> so who are you to be bossing me around? Oh, no, you can talk to me after you get some arrests on your belt. Or you can talk to me after you arrest the biggest kingpin in this neighborhood. Or better yet, talk to me after you got 10 years in the service. But until then, I am captain over you. No promotion needed. Got it? Rookie? Yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. What? Who am I? I told you what my name is, huh? Who am I, rookie? Captain. It's Cap for short. <laughs> Has a nice ring to it, huh? Now get your rookie ass to that door and handle the call. Yes, sir. I mean, Cap. You officers? We heard a domestic dispute complete come from this address, ma'am. I'm sorry, you have the wrong address. No, we have the right address. Like I said, officers, you have the wrong address. Uh, can you go check your records or something? <clears throat> sorry to waste your time. We'll go check. No, no, no. We're not gonna check. We have the right address. Like I said, I didn't call the police. Wait a minute, she didn't call y'all. I did. She took my freaking phone away and she won't give it back. Sydney, you called the cops on your own mother? Yes, I did. I took her phone because she has been acting up lately. I asked her to do her homework and the dishes and she ignored me. I asked her, three times and she continued to ignore me. So yes, I took her phone away and I'm keeping it until she learns some respect and how to keep her room clean and do her homework. Go do the dishes. I don't have to listen to you. I have rights. My teacher told me if I feel threatened or in danger, I can call the cops, even if it's on my own family. Okay, so let me get this straight. You called the police on your mom because she took your phone away? Yeah, and if she doesn't give it back, I want her arrested. Okay. Ma'am, give her her phone back. <laughs> I'm not giving her anything, especially something I pay the bill on. Look, not the police or some teacher is gonna tell me how to raise my kids. So you guys can go have a nice day and go catch some real criminals. The only criminal I see right now is you. Now give her her phone back. Ma'am, please listen to him and give her her phone back. Unless you want to be arrested for robbery or grand theft person, give her her phone back, and I mean now. I need you to call your supervisor before this gets out of hand. It's already out of hand. Put your arms behind your no. back. You are under arrest. No. no. For grand theft person. Oh, and that uh gets you about three to five years for the first offense. Huh? What? That's not fair! Mom, let her go! Let her go! Come on, Foster, this is excessive. It's just a family dispute. Let him go. No, no, no. No, she wanted her mommy arrested, right? Isn't that what you wanted? Huh? And no. you're not gonna get your phone back because I'm taking it into evidence. No, I changed my mind! Come on, man, this is excessive. We can get in trouble. This is what the brat wanted. 
She said she was exercising a right, the right her stupid, idiotic teacher told her she had. Am I wrong for letting her exercise her rights? No, please! I changed my mind! Let her go! I don't want my phone! Come on, man. Let's get out of here. Alright. I'll let her go this time. Listen here, little kid. Anytime I get a phone call from this address, because you're not doing your dishes or your homework, or not listening to your mom, I'm gonna take you to a place where little bratty kids go. Got it? Get out of my house, you bum jerk. Oh, don't act like you didn't like almost getting handcuffed. I could tell you like, your husband would have been jealous. <laughs> I'm gonna call my husband and your supervisor. You are gonna pay for this. It's love community service. This is where I draw the freaking line, Foster. I don't mess with women, and I sure as hell don't mess with kids. I'm done. When we get back, I'm calling it in. I want to request a new partner. Uh-huh. You watch your tone with me, OK, rookie? Huh? I don't care what you think you're going to do, because you can't even report me. Remember, I am your captain. I'll tell you when you can call me Foster. Get your hands off me. Don't look now, but we got company. What you worried for? We ain't did nothing. Yeah, that's true. Don't worry about it. I got the dash cam going anyway. Hands where I can see them, boys. Don't worry about that. Boy, license and registration, boys. <laughs> I'm gonna need to see his license too. Yeah, man, he's just a passenger. Why do you need his license? Listen to your partner. You know what? Can you tell us why you pulled us over? I'll tell you what you need to know. Now, license and registration, that goes for the passenger as well. I didn't give you nothing. I didn't drive. I know my rights. Listen, man, stay still. Lay some hard heads. What are we doing now, Foster? Looks like it's going to be a tough one. I'm tired of these clowns. I'm about to get out of the car. No, That's exactly what they want you to do. All right. You're going to get out of this car, or there's going to be some trouble. It's not a vehicle. If I have to pull you guys out of the car, I'm going to arrest you both. I don't feel safe keeping my hands on the steering wheel. I need you to call your supervisor and your watch commander. I've had it. Get out the car what? now! What are you what? doing? Are you... Wait, Come on! Oh, please. Out of the car! I'm tired of you playing. Get against the car! <laughs> oh, man. Yo, y'all got the wrong guy. I'm yeah. telling y'all. You really, you really that pulled over the wrong person, man. Wrong guy, I'm telling you, y'all got the wrong one. That's you know what, what if it, the shoe was on the other foot? Yeah. Think about it. I'm telling you, How would got, you respond? Y'all oh. got the wrong one. Oh. Huh. What would I do if the tables were turned? Hmm. Well, let me think about it. I often wondered what that would be like. Use that brain. Oh, wait, we have company. Oh, shit. Don't worry, we didn't do anything. But it's okay. They got their guns out. Don't worry, we didn't do anything. All right, hands where I can see them. And no sudden movements. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. What are you doing in this neighborhood? I just chill him. Drop my son off at his friend's house, officer. I don't uh, believe him. I think you're here to sell some drugs. Yeah, you know what? Yeah. They look high to me. Yeah. Well, officer, give us a break. We had not done any drugs. I'm not selling drugs. I need your license, registration, passenger ID, right now! I don't want to move my hands off the wheel. What did I just tell you to do? I don't want to move my hands off the wheel. Okay, can you please call your supervisor to this? Oh, 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 you want me to <laughs> call no my supervisor? Supervisor? <laughs> supervisor? We are the supervisors. What? Right. Um, what? Am I not pretty enough to be a supervisor? You look what pretty, you pretty to me. Yes, yeah, right, baby. That's right. Am I not pretty enough? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. Right oh, back that's at what you. I yeah. thought. <laughs> you know what? Now get your nail behind it's off the car. Okay. All right. Come on. Okay. Come get out. I'm, hey. coming. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Hands on the vehicle. Don't you think you're being a little too rough? Yeah. Too rough. I'm sorry, princess. Hands on the car. Hey, your body can't work. Body Does can. the body can work? 
This is cop jewelry. Yeah, that's right. Don't it go on my pretty supervisor face? Yes, Dust it does. Face? It goes well with it. No, ah, I'm not done with hands you. on the vehicle. Okay. What did I, I ask you to do? Uh, I'm, I'm a... Hey, quit, quit resisting. Quit resisting. He's resisting. resisting. No. He's resisting. No! No! <laughs> what did you do? What did you do? Why? Nah, that would never happen. Now, hands behind your back. Oh, oh y'all gonna regret this. Huh. You know what? This is racial profiling. You know that? Uh-huh. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I told y'all, wrong guy. regret this, man. Wrong guy. <laughs> You're going to regret this. Uh-huh. Yep. You know? Well, oh, you're going to put some cuffs on me, too. OK. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. While you're doing that, why don't somebody check for my ID? Okay. Yeah, where's your ID? Yeah, check for it. It's in my back pocket. Uh-huh. Homie. Homie. Where? Yeah, where's your ID? That. Homie. Go ahead. Go ahead. Pull it out. Pull it out. Pull it out. Hey. Take it. You lost it. Come on. Get it out. I'm telling you. Wrong guy. Wrong guy. What that say? Yeah. What is that? FBI. What that say now? Exactly. Oh Freaking God. Yeah. Uh -huh. Y'all done effed up. Yeah. Take the cuffs off. What that say? Yeah. Y'all done effed up. Yeah. Yeah, I told y'all, mother. I told y'all. I said take the cuffs off. Take them off. Let's go. Come on. Holy. Told y'all. Wrong Let's go. guy. Y'all done effed up. <laughs> yeah. Y'all about to yeah. lose y'all job. What the, what's going to happen? They about to lose, lose their job. job. They oh, yeah. Lose their job. Come on. Yeah. Look at her. Now, she was on the other foot, like I said. How do you feel now? This is our show. Ain't it? Let them know. I said this is our show. Ain't it? You see, King Kong ain't got nothing on me. Think about it. Yeah. Think about yeah. it. So, the same ass that you kicked today they be the same ass you gotta kiss tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so you remember that, punk. Punk. Come on, let's get out. Yeah, yeah, yeah get, get out, out of here. here. You know what? I can take this car now. Let's go. Yeah. Look at him. Honey, honey, where are you? Oh my God, there were these cops. They came to the house. They tried to arrest me and put me in handcuffs. Baby, I almost end up in the backseat of a police car. I, I think I know one of their names was Officer Foster, and you go do the dishes. Yeah, I think I ran into the same cops that you ran into. <laughs>